Beginning sequence, come to your senses, slight shaking, all the spaghetti arms. Awakening the chi is very good, is a very good exercise for your own practice. And standing around like a bamboo tree in the bamboo forest. Not stiff. And then a very brief round with our brush your knee because you can look it up. Last video for instance. And then something different. Okay, let's begin. And nice sunshine. Nice sunshine. That was my my shaking, you know. That's all I, I needed. Yes, really. If you need a sensual, a sensual input, because you're new to it, give yourself sensual input. Spaghetti arms. Or shaking, do rough shaking. Just keep contact to the earth with your soles of your feet. Everything else can shake like crazy. <laughs> I don't need it today. Keep up, keep up. Of course, and thank you for watching or even performing with me. I hope the later. I try to send you my Reiki energy, but that might be not enough. <laughs> So you have to really perform along, you know. And become your own master, of course. Develop your inner smile. Get to know your own hindrances. Get to know your own bodily feelings and your body at least that's what we are aiming for getting relaxed of course or even a little bit sloppy in the first 10 years you can free up all the trapped tensions 
all the micro and bigger stories trapped within your body. You don't need them, you know. Loosen up is the first goal for the first decade. And then, then you might be able to feel something like chi. Because there's no hindrance, no mental and no physical bodily hindrance, you know. And then, I think, then is the good time to feel your meridians and and get to know which meridian is causing what and so forth and really become your own master. That's more important than going to the Qigong practice hour and feel good and afterwards the normal life is hitting you hard and you don't know how to deal with it and the next nice yoga session and so forth, no. Really learning about yourself, your mental habits and slowly directing yourself and your life to more healthy, happy, holy life, you know? I think that's the, a better way, at least for me. And that's what I'm teaching, you know? So that's not, it's ne ne negative marketing. <laughs> basic standing position or hugging the tree or standing like a bamboo tree never finished always body scan inhale a little bit to the heaven relaxed and a little bit relaxing to the ground while exhaling. Always finding a more relaxed way to stand like brother tree. you can stand around until you really think you can feel the next tree to you. For the last topic, there is no scientific evidence. But you can feel like it.
three breathing cycles in your own pace. Basic standing position. Training your body perception by asking yourself, how do I feel now? Without any answer. The answer is your further evolving bodily feeling. Nice. First segment. Thank you for performing along with this first segment. I will have a brief look into the chart. Yes, very short. Very short round with brushing your knee. Because you can look it up, you know. And you have to perform it yourself. Really. Otherwise, you won't be able to remember the movements. So, just feel comfortable. The first snapshot, feel comfortable with the next, with the second one. Feel comfortable with the third one. Feel comfortable with the fourth one. Oh, that's not so easy. Yeah, always taking care of the angle of the hip. Yes. Relax, of course. And then the other side. Just one round. Ah, it, fe it feels so nice, you know. Just step and of course that's really nice you know just walking around performing a loop And when, when you're really aware of your movements, every split second is an opportunity to learn about yourself. In the first place about your body, but also about your mental habits, you know? Wow, well, in German it's called Schweinehund, you know, to overcome your inner Schweinehund. And that's the Schweinehund is the monkey mind, you know. We don't overcome our monkey mind because we need it. That's our ability to plan and so forth. We don't have to overcome our ability to think logic, you know. <laughs> our ability to of logic thinking. That's also our monkey mind, so we don't suppress it. No? 
monkey mind likes to play and will like to have new input and so forth but it's also attracted by bad habits fear for instance spinning around 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 and blowing up a topic which is otherwise nothing to fear about you know so get to know about your mental habits is really healthy you know? because you're you're not carrying so much physical tension and you are not carrying so much mental stuff around you know old stories the fear and greed and hate of something which isn't really worth thinking about you know? but that's my way you know learning learning about yourself becoming your own teacher that's really for me the most important topic to bring it to you the other way would be more beneficial for my purse you know you know qigong for the flow feeling and so forth yoga for your lower back pain and so you can do it but that's not my way I'm teaching the way how you can find out how to move yourself to get mm, in, a, in a better healthy mental and physical state, you know. I think that's a better way. Enough. Enough for today already. Just our beloved 